blessed days of fast of all today on the third sunday of great lent we have before us the story of jesus healing the paralyzed man and who has friends who cared for him and brought him to lord to be healed i'm sure that everyone is familiar with the story the gospel demonstrates that faith is not something to be talked about but must be demonstrated in the way we live in verse 5 of the gospel we read that jesus saw their faith most people would say that we cannot see faith because it is not available in the physical or visible form but jesus saw the faith of these four men even the crowd that surrounded jesus in this room were neutralized by the same curiousness of approaching jesus as jesus entered the town of capernaum his followers on knowing his arrival immediately gathered together so that there was no longer space in the room to occupy no even near the door and as jesus preached the word to them four men appeared and brought a paralyzed man along with them learning that jesus was healing the sick people all across the place being unable to reach near jesus because of the crowd they removed the roof above him and as they dug an opening they lowered down the pallet on which the paralytic was lying jesus was moved and said to the paralytic son your sins are forgiven some of the scripts sitting there reason to their heart who can forgive sins but god alone jesus perceiving this in his spirit said to them why do you question these type of things in your heart the son of man has the power on earth to forgive sins and he immediately told to the paralytic i say to you rise take up your mat and go to your home and the paralytic immediately rose took up his mat and walked out in presence of them all all were amazed and glorified god and said that we have never seen anything like this now what jesus meant is to say that the paralytic person need not longer carry the humiliation or guilt that he had been carrying hereafter throughout this miracle there are few things that needs to be understood firstly the power of faith four friends who tried to help his paralytic friend read jesus understood that there is no way to get through they carried him over dug an opening and lowered him down in front of jesus jesus was moved by their faith they were impressed by the teachings of jesus and surely because of that they were persistent enough to carry him over dug an opening and lowered him down in other words we also need to be involved in the lives of others it's so easy to sit back wrapped up in our own lives and problems so that we don't have time to care about anyone else secondly the healing in this miracle reminds us that church is a spiritual hospital for sinners the gathering in the house reminds us the gathering in the church where we have a face to face encounter with our physician our lord who provides us both spiritual as well as physical healing lastly lots of four people who wouldn't give up these four people who brought their friend to jesus understood that there is no room to get through but their faith was so great that wouldn't stop them from letting to see jesus like these four men we also need to be so persistent in our life so that we can accomplish those things that we tend to procrastinate in our life by realizing the power of god who strengthens us wishing everyone a blessed lenten season thank you